Hey everyone and welcome to another video. Um, for today's video, we're gonna be doing a face rug of the rapper ASAP Rocky. Uh, I've done a lot of face rugs in the past. It's some of my favorite rugs to do. So uh, let's get started. So as always, first things first, we're gonna head out to my little supply closet and grab the supplies needed for this rug. After that, we will begin stretching the fabric onto the frame, ensuring that each side has a tight fit. I'll then grab my projector and project the image onto the fabric. Before I move on, I'll quickly explain how I do these face rugs. What I do is I find an image of the person's face that I'd like to do, and I bring it into Illustrator and do an image trace, which gives me a better perspective on what colors to use. To see more of the face rugs that I've done, be sure to check out my Instagram at dw.rugs. Now that the image is all traced, it's time to begin. Here's the tufting gun I'll be using, as well as these little fabric scissors and of course the threader tool to get the yarn into the gun. As always, I'll go one color at a time, starting with the color white for this rug. This rug only consists of 8 colors, which is rather easy. Now just sit back and enjoy some tufting.
always like to mention my weird method of spooling yarn. For those that don't know, I use old toilet paper rolls to spool my yarn. It's a technique I saw someone use on Instagram a while back, and I've been using it ever since. As the rug is finishing up, please be sure to leave a like, comment, or subscribe. I hope to reach 100 subscribers after uploading this video. With the tufting all done, I'll go grab my Roberts 3095 carpet adhesive to apply to the back of the rug to ensure a strong hold. Since I did the rug rather early in the day, I'll point my fan at it so that it will dry within the next few hours so that I can put the backing on. I usually purchase my backing from the craft store Joanne. Now it's time to shave the rug down to get a nice even finish.
lastly, the final vacuum to reveal the final product. Thank you all so much for watching, and be sure to like, comment, or subscribe. The support means a lot to me as I continue to grow this channel. And also feel free to check out my Instagram, at dw.rugs, where I post all of my work. This rug is for sale, so if you're interested in purchasing, feel free to message me on there. Cheers, everyone.